playing uh, takes a lot of courage to play. In uh, the very serious world that we live in, we, uh, as a society, we've forgotten, uh, in a sense, about, about playing and just about enjoying uh, the childlike qualities that we all harbor inside ourselves, but we've been conditioned to turn off. street, people walk with their blinders, with our faces and mm, very little interaction, and, and that's the world over. And uh, street theater is such a place where you have the tools to remove these blinders and let people in on something that they wouldn't normally interact with uh, or act upon. contact with people then you're going to start learning about about how how people can affect you like if people affect you in a bad way if people are very negative in the show you can end up feeling uh, quite quite hurt until you until you build enough armor to put, your, put yourself inside a little bit of a shell and even though you're out there you're actually just acting and people's reaction shouldn't affect you too much you know, that takes a long time a lot of like personal feeling of rejection comes a lot in the beginning but I think the best thing in a show is to read people and get those people to basically like you. I think that the, the goal of any show, regardless of what, where it's performed, is to get people, the audience, to like you. You are here. Here I am. Here is what I'm offering. Do you receive it? And when they do, you're immediately, you feel something, some satisfaction. Some people come up and say, that was horrible. I didn't like the show. I didn't like this and this. And I say, well, you stayed. Something made him stay. At least out there, I've got the control. It's my, you know, corner. I'm, I'm the boss. I say, here's the show. Here's what it is. Here's the statement. Now you can go, whether you give or not. You have more room to, you have more opportunity for a reaction because their expectations are nil. I like taking people just to that level, like taking them on that tightrope, wobbling the tightrope, but not making them fall. Hi, what's your name? George. George, this is Tracy. Tracy, George. Why don't you go, we're gonna, now, when they come back from the date, we're gonna find out everything that happened. <laughs> Thank you.
might want to go out for another soda after having that bit of a chat in there. He's... Oh, say that again? Yeah. And would you like to go out on maybe, possibly for... Mm-hmm. It's a, it's a, what do you think, guys? Do you think we have a cup? Do you think so? Why not? Why not? Okay, well, just, just for the audience, how about just a little, you know, just a, just a, you know, a little, a little... Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, not with me, with her. Just a little... Uh, yeah, yeah, just, what do you say, guys, yeah? Just a, yeah, for the audience, for the, for the audience, just a, a bit of a kiss. Kiss, kiss her! Yeah, all right, just, no, don't, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, don't, don't, get your, get, just go back out. Give him a big hand for helping out. All right, sugar, from Wellington. Very easy, that's a straight jacket. All I want you to do, sweetheart, is tie me up. <laughs> I love doing it. It's the best drug in the whole world for me. The adrenaline and being able to open people up. Go, tie me up, big boy. <laughs> Five shots.